Yeah! Hola gang, and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, I'm your old nerd of the day. And I try things so you don't have to. I am over here at Taco Bell to try one of their brand new, limited time, I think, triple melt products. This is the triple melt nachos. As you probably know, I am a huge fan of their triple layer nachos. One of my favorite things to get on their dollar menus and a good amount of stuff for the price. When I heard about these, I thought another nacho product to add to my my like list, my love list, let, maybe. Let us go to the clipboard of fluff. The Taco Bell Triple Melt Nachos consists of seasoned beef, three cheese blend, and nacho cheese sauce, and chips, of course. Went through the drive-thru, and there is the bag. Gave me napkins, got a spork, and this is the wrong thing. These are triple layer nachos. This is not what I ordered. Okay, I went in and got the right thing. Same kind of bag. I'll be using my handy dandy steering wheel desk slash tray here. There's the box. And there is what we're looking at. You see your nachos there. You see your triple layer cheese. Nacho cheese mixed somewhere in there and they're special seasoned beef. Unlike the triple layer, they come in this little rectangular box. So there's not a lot that can fit in here. It looks like you're trying to fit, they're trying to fit a lot of ingredients, five in total, if you count all three cheeses, including the nacho cheese and the seasoned beef, um, on a, a small box of chips. Found a pretty decent chip there, all the cheese on there and the seasoned beef. Let's give it a shot. So it's very awkward in this small box to get all this stuff on here. It's kind of like trying to fit an elephant on the top of a pin. You know what I'm saying? So I'm trying to get a bunch more on another chip so I can try it, which is not easy. Dang. Yeah. Okay, by the numbers. First of all, it's a small box. It's not a tray which I like the tray because the, the chips, there's more of them, first of all, and second of all, they're spread out a lot better. So any ingredients that they put on top of those chips is spread out on the chips. You're not fighting to, to get stuff on them because some of the ingredients is like right on top and then other chips are like bare naked. Uh, the seasoned beef is nice. I've always liked their seasoned beef, same seasoned beef that they put in burritos, and their tacos. Then the cheese. Um, it's it's cheese. It's it's more cheesy because they have more cheese um, in the the box here. But it, it's I don't know. It's okay. I really don't. I, I'm having a hard time tasting the nacho cheese. I don't know if they put a lot of nacho cheese on here, which I like. Uh, they pour more of the uh, three cheese blend on here, which is kind of half melted. It's not like the nacho cheese melted. Now on the website and on the commercials for this and the burrito, the damage for either one and specifically the nachos, of course, we're talking about, says a dollar. Not so. This is the second Taco Bell I've come past that these are running a dollar twenty-nine on the Nerdometer. I would give the Taco Bell triple melt nachos. I think I would give these a. I think I would give these a middle of the road meh, <clears throat> bordering on a low meh. And the reason why, first of all, not enough chips in a very tight container for all the ingredients that they're trying to put in here. Second of all, bait and switch really ticks me off. And that's basically what they've done. They've advertised these for a dollar. Then you get in there and they're gonna charge you a dollar twenty-nine. The problem cost-wise is not the price, but the fact that they advertise it for a dollar and then charge you $1.29. That is not nice, Taco Bell. Not 
freaking nice. What's up with that? The one cool thing about the mishap of them giving me the wrong product is I get to show you the comparison that I wanted to show you. So see, this is a tray. This is the triple layer nachos. This is a tray of triple layer nachos. As you can see, there's a lot more chips to that. It's not just a matter of them being spread out. There is a lot more chips on this. This consists of the, the uh, chips, the nacho cheese sauce, uh, refried beans, and a spicy red sauce. Now I always take the spicy red sauce off because it adds a lot of heat to it, and I don't like a lot of heat. Plus when they say this is a dollar, it's a dollar. So if they were to make their triple layer nachos like this and add the uh, seasoned meat to it, the triple cheese to it, um, take away the red sauce, of course, because that's not supposed to be on there, and the beans. This would make for a really good, I, I would I would give this a, probably a high I like it, or somewhere around there. Would I recommend this? No. Um, it's, it's gimmicky. It's gimmicky. You're not getting what you paid for, what you expected to pay for. Liar, liar, pants on fire fire Taco Bell and there's just not enough chips for the amount of ingredients ingredients they're packing on here pass by the nachos give the burrito a try that might be pretty good that that should be pretty good but it's also listed as a dollar and advertised as a dollar and then you get in there and it's a dollar 29 again so that right there leaves a bad taste in my mouth straight out of the gate without trying it just gimmicky gimmicky gimmicky. There you go, gang. Another review in the bag. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And remember, I put out videos every Sunday and every Wednesday, live chat every Monday on YouTube and on Twitch, live streaming weekly, multiple times a week on Twitch. All links are down below. You can catch me on my website, oldnerdreviews.com, and you too can become, you too can become a part of the Old Nerd Crony community. You guys have a freaking awesome day, and I'll talk to you again. Bye now.